a victory here today. A fourth in a row in all competitions, a third in the league, a third 1-0 in the league. That's some great stats. What did you make of the performance? I thought first half the performance was exceptional, to be brutally honest. You know, This is a difficult team to play, like I told you before. They're a very, very good team going forward. You know, Their transitional play, their attacking play is extremely good. And especially in that first 20 minutes, you know, from all the games we've obviously analysed, you know, they're always a threat. You know, they took a 2-0 lead against Orlando Pirates within the first 10 minutes. You know, but as the game goes on, opportunities will come. And I thought defensively we were well-structured, well-organised. I thought we frustrated them in that first half. They, they couldn't find solutions. They were looking to try and then play the ball through the middle, which we intercepted. And I thought our transitions could have been a little bit better because there was opportunities there to really, really punish them. You know, but we created one or two small chances, I thought, better than them in the, in the first half. And then, like I said to you before the game, this game is going to be about mistakes. And the mistake happened, unfortunately, the bounce hit the arm and we got the penalty and we took the one lead. And I think the first half performance, we deserved that. And then second half, we wanted more. We didn't want the guys to sit back. We wanted us to look to go and get the second goal and look to try and get the third. They need to take risk. You know, we spoke about this in the changing room. But, you know, the players started sitting off. We started backing off. We started giving them space. They changed the formation. Uh, we started to struggle. They started to play the balls through the middle of us and started to create more situations. But we defended extremely well, you know. But we looked to then just try and secure the result. I don't think we played very, very well in that second half. We needed to hold on to the ball a little bit longer. Every time we're in defence, when we win it, we need to try and hold it and keep it and try and control the match. But we didn't do that in the second half. So we had to absorb a lot of pressure in that second half. I'm curious about the change because um, I'm talking about the Buchanan for Class and from where we were sitting, it looked like a lot of the attack was coming through Dalen Class and a lot of the stuff on the break was coming through him as well. And then you brought on Keegan. I'm, I'm curious about that. Yeah, I've, I just felt at the time, like I said to you, we were losing a lot of balls. You know, as much as Dalen was winning a lot of balls, he was also giving away a lot of balls. Plus, we were becoming very, very one-dimensional. We were looking to find the nearest man. You know, whereas the space was actually in the wide areas and Keegan will provide you that. Keegan has the ability to play very, very good diagonal balls and that's what we needed to try and do to try and hurt them. But even with his introduction, you know, we still struggled. We still struggled, which is obviously something we need to go back and, and work on. You know, we've got to be able to, to cope with that pressure and then when we do win the ball, try and maintain it for, for longer periods. We're not doing that. We, we're making one or two passes and then we're losing it. And now we're having to absorb the pressure again, you know. But it wasn't only Dalen, everybody, you know. I, I saw Shandu lose a lot of balls. Konene was losing a lot of balls. Even Siander was losing a lot of balls. We weren't looking to really keep it as, as long as we should have. You know, and that's what we hoped Keegan would bring us uh, when we brought him on. Coach, a third 1-0 victory in the ABSA Premiership in succession. Congratulations. Well done tonight. Thank you.